So there's people on the internet that make like fake profiles and stuff and <clears throat> they'll post things for like shock value or whatever. Like they'll say racist comments or they'll um, make a comment about like a, uh, like about women or about men or whatever. Um, your nationality and like they'll make a fake profile to have a really ugly picture right and then it'll have like a pinch of stuff on their page about them and then they'll post like a bulletin or a blog or you know some sort of media that other people can see or even like a YouTube video or on YouTube right so they'll post a video talking about like Oh, yeah, all you niggers, I can't stand you guys, or you spicks, or all you crackers, and chinks, and, you know, ragheads, whatever. Like, they'll say all kinds of crazy stuff. Do you guys realize that it's just to get views, or it's just to get, like, negative feedback? These people don't really care about what you think about what they just said. You're gonna sit there and write them and talk about, like, well, you know, that's, that's, irrelevant or this is disrespectful and you don't know what you're talking about and you know I don't I don't identify with what you just said and I'm a black female or you know I'm an Asian female and I can drive like what are you talking about Why are you even entertaining them at all whether you talk to them politely or whether you stoop down to their quote-unquote level because they're not even really on a level they're just acting like right now I could make a video and be like, I can't stand Asian bitches. Y'all can't drive. Y'all can't see straight because your eyes are so small. Like just stuff like that. And I don't mean it, but I can say it because it's all the stereotypes, nothing original. All the stereotypes that people use every day, all the time, in every blog, every newspaper, Perez Hilton, whoever, everybody. So why are you gonna sit there and try to teach them a lesson or try to preach to them like your gospel when they're not even interested in what you're gonna say they'd rather you be like fuck you bitch and go about your day right right so yeah. and this is gonna be one of those videos that people are gonna feel like they need to respond to because you're gonna think I'm talking to you but I'm not so yeah, save it or comment, whatever. I don't care. Maybe this is my crazy video. Maybe this is my crazy blog. Not really. But yeah, it's. <sighs> it makes me laugh because I just. I don't understand. I don't. You're basically giving them exactly what they want by commenting, by responding by acting crazy by being offended and this person is just going to continue to toy with you and act on nonchalant and oblivious and have fun with you like so why even put forth the effort or maybe this is your way of feeling like you're connected to the world so who am i to tell you to stop i'm just saying um just a little advice don't feed into the hype like it's really not that serious if you don't identify with what they're talking about if you live in a nice home if you're not connected to a stripper pole more than 90 percent of your day and if you take care of your kids if you are a good member of the family um if you take care of yourself if you think that you're attractive if you feel like you know you don't want your hair to be natural you'd rather do a relaxer or a color or whatever and you know the person's talking about well you know all black people they gotta wear weaves and whatnot if you like the stuff that you got in your head if you like your makeup if you like your clothes if you like your body if you like you then don't worry about it okay all right pumpkin <laughs>